he is rumored to be dating one of the most famous women in the world and routinely gets to sit with comedy legends while watching his favorite basketball team. Life is good if you are Pete Davidson. The 28-year-old Saturday Night Live cast member had a big smile on his face as he posed with his thumb up while courtside as his hometown New York Knicks welcomed the Golden State Warriors on Tuesday night. No wonder he was in great spirits as he sat with two comedy legends, Chris Rock and Jon Stewart, at the iconic Madison Square Garden. The trio were lucky to be on hand as they witnessed history as Stephen Curry broke the career three-point record with 2,974 eclipsing former long-range King Ray Allen. Shortly after the 33-year-old guard earned his place in history, Pete could be seen standing on his feet and cheering enthusiastically even despite him playing for the other team. The comedian was dressed for comfort in a bright pink graphic print hoodie, baggy blue jeans and sneakers. Unfortunately Pete's big game energy was not enough to push his Knicks as they ultimately lost out to the Warriors, 105-96. The outing comes days after reports that Pete's rumored love interest Kim Kardashian wants to be over and done with her marriage with artist Kanye West. In new court documents obtained by TMZ, the billionaire beauty boss admitted their union was unsalvageable despite his grandiose displays for forgiveness and to win her back. No counseling or reconciliation effort will be of any value at this time the court documents state. Irreconcilable differences have existed and continue to exist between, Kanye, and me, which have caused our marriage to irretrievably break down. Kim filed to be legally single and have her maiden name restored in documents registered on Friday, and is patiently awaiting a judge to sign off on the paperwork to designate her a single woman. The Keeping Up With The Kardashian star added, I have been attempting to settle our dissolution with, Kanye, since I filed for divorce in February 2021. I have requested several times that, Kanye, agree to bifurcate and terminate our marital status. He, has not responded to my request. Kanye, and I both deserve the opportunity to build new lives. Therefore, I am asking that my request to bifurcate and terminate our marital status be granted. Just last week, Kanye begged for Kim to run right back to me amid their divorce during a free Larry Hoover concert on Thursday which she attended. Perhaps the most interesting thing to note in the recent filing is that Kim wants her maiden name restored, which means dropping West from her moniker despite her businesses like KKW Beauty and KKW Fragrance, using her married initials. The legal move is asking the judge to separate the issues of child custody, property, and financial implications from actual marital status. Pete and Kim recently confirmed their romance, following being spotted on a handful of outings on the East and West Coasts. Davidson even brought in his 28th birthday at the reality TV star's mom's Palm Springs mansion. The new couple was seen rocking matching pajamas from Kardashian's Skims line as they hung out with Kris Jenner and rapper Flavor Flav. Before Kim, the screenwriter was linked to a number of bombshell Hollywood starts including ex-fiancé Ariana Grande, Kate Beckinsale, and Phoebe Dynver.